Hello, my name is Luis Estrada, and I'm a software developer. In this video, I'll show you how to storyboard your website. This is a basic consideration at the time of planning your website. Creating a correct storyboard of your website will save you a lot of time in the future, and you will prevent common errors. A website is composed of a set of web pages with a common and defined purpose. It is not the same to create a personal website than it is to create a company website. Each one has its own needs and characteristics. Some of the most common characteristics of websites include personal websites designed to know more about the life and work of a person. This website is usually composed of just a few web pages. This is the simplest type of website and we can use free web hosting that in exchange for free hosting displays publicity banners on the pages. Company website. These types of websites are designed to present information about a company and its products or services. These websites can range from small to very large depending on the size of the company, the amount of product or service that the company sells, and the degree of contact with its client. A good example of a very large company website is Microsoft.com. This type of website usually requires its own dedicated web server and an own, its own internet address such as somecompany.com or somebusiness.com. For these videos, we will create a personal website. For this kind of website, a simple storyboard will consist of categories divided into folders. Inside each folder, we create HTML files for storing information for that category only. Each folder could contain a subfolder for storing images, videos, audio, and documents. For this simple website, we will use three categories only, family, friends, and music. I'm Luis Estrada, and I've just showed you how to create a multimedia website using FrontPage.